Hello everybody, Pete from AEA Northeast. Today I wanted to touch base and talk about the fill probes. And what I basically do when I put them into the air tube and how I set them up to fill up any of the AEA PCP guns that I use and I test and we ship out here. Basically the simplest thing here I do is if you look here on the fill probe at the top there's a little groove here. And that's basically my guide point that I use when filling all of my PCP rifles here with this. What I basically do is I'll just push it in. And I push it in up until I get that notch right to the edge of the fill hole here. That sets both O-rings inside at the proper distance when it builds up the pressure to fill up the air tube. I have one hooked up here to a little air compressor I use from time to time to put some air in some of these guns here. And we're going to do a quick little demonstration here on how I do it. So basically I insert it right up to the edge there where the notch is to the edge of the tube. And I get the little, it's going to be a little bit noisy here, but I just want to show you building up a little bit of pressure here and how I have it set. Turning on the fan is going to get noisy. As you can see, the compressor started to build up the pressure into the air tube. And once it builds up the pressure and sets the O-rings inside here, this gets nice and tight. You can't locks it in there nice and tight so you don't have to worry about it coming out. Again, like I said, I usually set the notch in the probe to the edge of the tube. And that lines everything up for you. Uh, we've been getting a couple of questions about this. And some of the new users here were trying to help out. A lot of you might know this already. Just as a little uh, informational thing here that I wanted to put together to help out some of our customers. If you have any questions, please let us know. Uh, hopefully that will take care of a few of the questions and uh, help some of our customers out. Thanks. Have a great day. Bye now.